remember being in my fraternity in college a, a few years ago, talking with some of the varsity athletes who are my brothers, and them saying that a woman would never be the head coach of a men's college basketball team, college wrestling team, or college football team. So it was awesome today to see the San Antonio Spurs named Becky Hammond, the first full-time female assistant coach for the NBA. It's a great step forward for women, breaking down some of these barriers that have been exclusive to only men for so long. But going on Twitter, it was interesting to me to see so many people kind of give all the credit to the Spurs for making this decision, and certainly the Spurs deserve a lot of applause, but Becky Hammond is the woman who made this happen. Becky is the one who is in there, uh, in the San Antonio program. She has worked with Greg Popovich before. She uh, is obviously bright and has a future in coaching. They didn't just go pluck some random woman off the street to fill a space that they had reserved for a female coach. Becky made this opportunity happen for herself because of who she is and her excellence. So certainly, the Spurs deserve a, a, a lot of credit for being open to this. But at the end of the day, this was a really a powerful woman opening an opportunity for herself. And, uh, and she's walking through it. So as people are giving all this credit to the Spurs, and, and the Spurs are, are my favorite NBA team just because of the incredible program that they have. I think people really have to focus on Becky and and Becky really knocking down this barrier, much the way say, the same way Michael Sam did. Certainly, the the Rams and Jeff Fisher Fisher get a lot of credit for bringing in Michael Sam, but it was Michael Sam who who knocked down that door. So, Becky, congratulations and thank you for being such an incredible, powerful woman who is going to open so many doors for so many women down the road.